This has been going on for over a decade. And one of the complications is that the it was very hard to figure out the chemical properties that were so attractive to eel and, and conch and the other animals that really like the like the horseshoe crab bait. And so they came up with a solution that requires a lot less of the material with other with other additives and as a way to have that have the same kind of catch response, but you require a lot less fresh horseshoe crab meat. Our first goal, which we weren't able to do, was to make an artificial, a completely artificial bait. Take the uh, take the attractant to the horseshoe crab and replicate it. We couldn't do that. So what we've come up with here is you take the horseshoe crab and you, you blend it with uh, some biodegradable chemicals and clam bellies, okay, which are also biodegradable. So everything's biodegradable. And we've come up with this formula to make this gel. And it eliminates, it's about a 15 to 1. It was 15 horseshoe crabs would take to do now what one horseshoe crab could do. The horseshoe crab really is absolutely foundational to everything that's special about the Delaware Bay Shore. If it wasn't for that incredible migration, we wouldn't have the half a million, half a million shorebirds that visit Delaware every year, the red knots and, 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 other, and other types of, of shorebirds that we see. And so conserving this population is absolutely critical, not only to the, the, the wildlife in our, in our state, but also to the economy. And, and this is a way to kind of have a win-win where we conserve these species while at the same time creating a new market economy at the same time.